You know, another thing I noticed about him, not naming his name, but <coughs> he, he goes by W-O-H. He says I'm a piece of shit, doesn't believe me. Um, he doubts me all the time. He's a debater. He likes controversy. I mean, he has a, <coughs> a way with his words, and he tries to get under my skin, but I try not to let him because I'm more thick-skinned than I am. He used to be thin-skinned, but not like So long story short, like he's uh, telling me all this tr talking trash as usual. W-O-H, you know who you are, W-O-H, and there's people like that that you think that they're the ones with the problems, and they're trying to put other people down just to boost them, th their egos up, because they're pathetic. I mean, they do whatever it takes to get on our nerves to make themselves look better, because they suck, because they're the ones with the real problems. That's the way I look at it. That's pretty much the scenario. When people belittle you and talk down to you, they're really the cowards. They're the ones with the problems, not us. I mean, yeah, we, we all have our... burdens and shit, but come on, get real, people. Get with the fucking program. Get with the damn program. tell you guys, I need some Kleenex, oh, fuck, people can be highly, clearly irritating on many levels, Fritos did alright with this, not shabby at all, can't beat it with a baseball bat, for the price, If it was up to me, guys, I'd have a house, probably be married, even though I'm not marriage material, probably. I would have been married if that was the case by now. I'd have my own house, I'd be holding my own weight, doing things on my own. You know, I mean, there comes a time when a man's got to be on his own. I've been on my own before in my life, and I will. I'm going to get my own place eventually. It just sucks. I'm down on my fucking luck like I... I'm on these damn hard times, it ain't my fucking fault. I do as much as I'm capable of. I mean, within my caliber, within my power, I do what I can. I give it my all for the most part. I'm not a miracle worker. I'm not a miracle maker or worker. I can't do. I mean, it just sucks. I mean, I'm really kind of pissed off and fed up. My mom, is. she's getting that. Like, she's just left to go to the store. She's getting, I mean, I don't know. She. I know she won't, would like to see me on my own. Shit's bullshit right now. It's, it's, you know, straight horse shit. And, you know, dog shit, if you ask me. Um, is it going to get better? I hope so. But, I mean, well, let me tell you guys something. I'm going to tell you guys something real quick, real quick, because I'm, I'm about to sign off here. Shout out to Rowdy, Rowdy Piper. I, I'm, I'm, I mean this to be, to be quite pretty, uh, you know, I ain't the brightest and smartest cat on the block, but I know a few things, and I will tell you this, a smart guy, or a happy guy, especially as you pushing your age up there. My only passion really in life was basketball. You can laugh at me, but that was my passion, playing piano be the days before I drank. But you can laugh at me, you can do what the fuck you want to do. And I was athletic. I used to be kind of athletic kind of guy. <coughs> you could laugh at me, and my health ain't great now, but fuck, you could laugh at me and do whatever the hell you want. But I'll tell you guys this. I know this for a damn fact. The happy guys, when they're my age and older, are the ones with a girl, with a female. Married, stable, 
has a partner, has someone in their life, but when you're alone, lonely, I know this, I've seen it on the news, on BBC or some TV show years ago, it was about these guys that are like in their 60s drinking whiskey, drinking, drinking themselves to death, because they're lonely, loneliness kills. And if you're a female or a girl watching this and you disagree, it's it's different. It's totally different. Uh, being a man, being a lady and lonely is way different than being a guy and lonely and deprived and you know suffering from loneliness. It's not the same. Being depressed, lonely, you know, it's it, it you know it takes a toll over the years. I I am being fucking for real. This is real, real talk. I'm not just putting on a front and shoving, sh blowing sunshine up your smoke up your ass. Sh sh I'm not sugarcoating shit. I'm telling you the real fucking truth. You can take it for what it's worth or just fucking, you know, dismiss what I'm saying. I don't give a shit what you do. I'm just speaking from my own experience, telling you guys what, what's up. Because I know I, I'm living it. And it ain't, it ain't fun. I try to make my own fun, but let me guys let me tell you guys something. It ain't cracked out what it's like it is. It's you know they say sex is overrated. Pussy ain't nothing but skin on a bone. You can fucking suck it or leave it alone. That ain't true. It ain't overrated. You know. I mean looks looks have a lot of looks have a lot to do with it and appearance. I base everything on physical beauty. You know. Some people say my standards is way up there. I'm like, fuck that. No, I would date a, I would date a plain Jane girl in a heartbeat. I would, I'd settle for an overweight girl as long as she has a pretty face. And there's compatibility. I I can kiss her. She got warts and nasty shit. But I'm like, fuck that. You know, hey, we all got you know, we all gotta set our standards somewhere. I'm just, all I know is I need to finish. Ah, seven minutes. I ain't as bad as I thought. And I'm just fed up, irritated. Some people say depression. Nah, I ain't really depressed. I'm just bummed out and in a funk. I'm just ticked off just ticked off and the sweet sweet uh, spicy sweet chili goes perfect with that dip I'm just like at what's in I'm like god damn but when it comes to <clears throat> me submitting and selling myself short, yes, I do. I don't upgrade. I just I'm I let people walk on me. I mean, I've been bullied in school all my life. Learning disabilities, special schools. Some people said I autism. My confidence always was fucked, and my self-esteem was always fucked. It. Growing up, I mean, I'm just being real. Um, dead serious, dead as, or I'm serious as, I'm serious, most people say I'm serious as cancer, well I'm serious as cancer, and I'm serious as a heart attack, and I'm serious as life, triple, there you go, and I'm doing a Burger King, a Burger King review, because I love Burger King, Nine minutes, God. and the battery's about to die. I talk too much. Ah, forgive me. I, I fucking yappy, 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 yap. Oh, Jesus, man, oh man. Uh, do it this way. My stomach is hurting right now. My stomach is fucking hurting. <coughs> that helped a little bit. You burp.
No, I'm doing a Burger King review because I like antique stores. I'm old fashioned. And I'm. I ain't gonna lie, I'm pissed off. I'm in a pissy mood right now. And I'm mad. Fucking frustrated. You know, to the fullest extent. But ain't nothing gonna change. I'm gonna be by myself, but beside myself, just doing my own thing. Hobbing along, one foot in front of the other. You know, I'm above the dirt, vertical, and breathing, I guess that's all that counts, I guess. Sometimes I wish that I wasn't even here, but I ain't, I ain't, don't get, don't take me the wrong way on the, I'm against, I don't believe in suicide, but, of course we've all considered that, but, uh, as far as, as far as committing, as far as going to that, uh, I wouldn't do that, but, I get, I just, I don't Drinking malt liquor. <clears throat> That's what separates the boys from the men. <sighs> I wasn't like flitting, but now I'm out like shouting. 